what is the flux on this disc-shaped surface? Well, once again, flux is the electric field times the area. Um, and we want the part of the electric field that is poking through the plane, perpendicular to the plane. Uh, we are given this angle theta here. So that's this angle in here. That means that we want the sine of the angle because the sine of that angle is going to give us the vertical component of the electric field. If you think about this, right, you have your horizontal component and your vertical component. This vertical component is opposite the angle theta, so that's going to be the sine of the angle times, which is going to give us the vertical component. So the magnitude of the electric field is 600 volts per meter. The area of the disk is pi r squared. Let's calculate that up here. Pi times the radius squared, and the radius is 3 centimeters, so that's 0.03 meters squared. So pi times 0.03 squared. And that gives us 0 0.002827 square meters. And then we are going to multiply that by the sine of 25 degrees. So our area times 600 volts per meter times the sine of 25 degrees. That gives us 0 0.71 seven volt meters and that looks like it is answer number six